we need like a question to spark the conversation here. And so we've uh, elicited, uh, this is Britt Wilbert saying, could a mini tournament three on three teams of four be used as a potential solution to the non-competitive no. nature of the current all-star game? So when you say non-competitive nature, are you talking about the dunk contest, or what, what are you talking about? <laughs> I don't know. No, I think they're – are they talking about the game itself? Oh, the game itself. No. I mean, they're trying something different this year with Team LeBron. Well, team, why, team why would Steph. you think if they're not going to play hard with five-on-five, five, they would play hard with three-on-three three or four-on-four? Four? Either either you're going to play hard or you're not. You know, I don't – It has nothing to do it's with – It's still a, it's still an exhibition. Right. It's still All-Star Weekend. Right. It's still yeah. – it's you know, you can play one-on-one, -on -one and it's not going to be – if they don't want it to be, they, it won't be. And, you know, Charles have always said this. You have an obligation to your team. So they're not really competing, but I don't like to use the word not compete because they're all competitors. But nobody wants to get hurt, especially yeah. when you're first and second of the week. Yeah, but y'all yeah. didn't so, score 190 points when y'all No, this, this is how we did. The first two quarters, we're not playing no defense. Third quarter, now the, the fourth quarter, especially if it was close, now we're trying to get the most money. And but that's, play like it's a pickup game in the summertime. Yeah, right. like, that's that's competitive, but not trying to get hurt. Right. Yeah, but that's when you risk waiting till the fourth quarter. If it's 25-point game after three, then you know there's not going to be any defense in the fourth quarter either. Right. How about Point. this? you got 24 players, right? 20, so why don't we have 12 one-on-one -on -one games? Exactly. Oh, my God. Oh, why don't we do a 12 and then on you 12? Advance, and then you advance, or 12 oh. on 12. 12 on 12 and make the basketball court two blocks. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be a good idea. Anyway, no timeouts. All of the, all of that. No timeouts. Uh, yeah, all of those time. very valid hey, every, ideas. Everything's on the table. Uh, and, and we uh, we're how about to, this? We're, Why don't we just have Golden State play anybody and make it the finals? Yeah, it's a good one. In the middle of the that season. was one of the worst ideas you ever. Well, seen. I got I'm an idea. Going with, this is a worst idea throwout. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it really Kenny. basically is. Kenny, um, Chuck, I got an idea. What? Yeah, do my idea? Sure. It has something to do with the dunk contest. Sure. Okay. Three street ball dunkers versus three NBA dunkers. I've always always said that, Shaq, because yes. I mean, the, the slam dunk competition we had on Turner was better than the ones we've had here recently. Yes, we should I, do that. The, 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 you mean the Dunk Kings? The Dunk Kings. The, some of those guys. Some, some of those, those guys are great right. dunkers, but yeah. there's a difference between being a great dunker and a great player. So I think that's... No, no, but this is well, the dunk, dunk contest. contest. Kings, it's dunk right. contest. But it, you, the, it's about the best players that are in the league. No. And then you know have, what? Have a million-dollar oh, purse, three, Chuck. Have, a, have the guys a million dollar in the purse, NBA Chuck. Right. against those guys on Dunk Kings. So why don't you just have guys on the million purse? You know why that's not going to work? Because you're going to have trouble getting the top dunkers in the NBA because they're going to say, I'm not going to get beat by some guy. That's all he does is On dunk dunking, right. yeah. So it's, it's like saying, okay, have a three-point contest. Well, they're not going to accept challenge. Just, That's what you tell Who could shoot threes? And somebody always find three guys off the street that really It's not ball. the same. What, right? You're just saying the same thing. Yeah. Why don't we just no, keep those it? those guys are professional Let's just dunkers. keep it to NBA guys. Thank you. You're NBA right. All-Star Weekend. Yeah. And, and here's the best of NBA All-Star Weekend here on uh, Outside the NBA on Facebook. It's just about All-Star Weekend on TNT. Well, here we are in, uh, in Los Angeles, and we are nearing our taping of uh, Family Feud. Family Feud, this dude better get all the answers right. Bunch of facts. But this is like the dream, right? To get these buttons, they're iconic. I'm so excited. Stick, man, I'm going to sue you. <laughs> this is one of my dreams right here. This moment. Ernie's my our ace in the hole. Ernie's a wealth of useless knowledge. He knows all the stupid stuff in the world. The person I trust the least is a, is a coin flip between Kenny and Shaq. Everybody on Family Food staff, if you give us the answers, we'll give us a check. Million dollars. Oh, what? Million. oh, we don't even want a million. Yeah, 10,000 cash. 10 cash. We're just crossing our fingers that we're not the dumbest ones here, but the likelihood is that we are. <laughs> We were very quick on the on the I buzzer. So I think too. our team our team overall was very quick. We tried on the to buzzer. make that a focus. We yes. tried to make that a focus. Yeah, in all of our sure. in all of our workouts, it was a blast, man. A whole new a whole new appreciation for uh, standing there trying to hit that buzzer when you sit at when you sit at home. It's like, oh, that's a piece of cake. What are you doing, you knucklehead? Why didn't you say this? What's up? We just finished Family Feud. I'm not gonna tell you who won or lost, but all I'm gonna tell you is. I have some really great answers. Family Feud, my favorite show of all time. Hey, Chuck here at Jimmy Kimmel, popping up All-Star Weekend. Looking forward to the show tonight. 
Been here a few times. It's gonna be great to see Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love GSP. Those are So listen, guys. I know this might come as shock to y'all. I'm not this pretty until I get makeup on. I see it coming. It's coming. It's coming to me, y'all. <laughs> Uh, I just told Jimmy I gotta do this more often. Yeah. Oh man, thank you for having me. Thank you, Legend. And it don't it don't stop. All Star Weekend. This is why we're here. It don't need no introduction. The ATL of Hollywood. This is Luda, man. If you don't know, you would never know. Gotta have some fun, baby. Yes, sir. Find Jerry Griffin. Find Jerry Griffin. Find Jerry Griffin. What's good, guys? You guys know who it is, Nate Rob. I'm helping out with TNT tonight, man. I got Shaq, Chuck, all the greats here, having a good time. 2018 All-Star Weekend, LA, slam dunk, skill down, three point, let's get it. Y'all know what it is, staying fresh and so clean. Overtime, we going, baby. I guess we're getting recognized for being a slam dunk competition, bringing, you know, changing the game, changing the culture of it. I'm surprised that 25 is not even close to winning. First of all, guys, I had a blast. You guys were chilling with me out here in LA for the All-Star Weekend, Slam Dunk Skill Challenge three-point contest. We had a blast, it was nothing but fun. I got a chance to go backstage, back in the back scene. Area 21, shout out KG, Chuck, Paul Pierce, everybody, it was fun. You guys saw, we came, we conquered, it was lit, turn up, let's get it.